Hello everybody and welcome to another video. Today is a different video and it's a lot different because you know what I usually do. I usually do games but I still can't screen record. But today is a bit more of a different video because today we are doing my mid-season AFL 2022 ladder and season finals prediction. Remember I'm going to do one closer in like... February or March, you know, February next year to really get a gist of everything. So, yeah, let's get right into it. And starting off in 18th, I think will be the Hawks. The Hawthorne Hawks. Can't really see it because of the light shining into my lounge room right now. But, oh, here we go. No, it was just a bit bent. There you go, the Hawthorne Hawks. Will be starting in 18th will be ending in 18th next year only really just because i feel like they're not up to scratch and they're just really a placement team in the afl currently i just don't think they'll go back to what they were like seven six eight six seven eight years ago now in 17th next year i personally think it will be where are they where are they where are they no. Sorry guys, I got them all on paper. So I can't find the team that I'm looking for. Here we go. I personally think it's North Melbourne. Yeah, they were they are eighteenth now but and they have found their groove and I know that for sure, but you know, I just don't think they'll be able to compete against, you know, your Collingwoods, your Richmonds, your Brisbane's, your Bulldogs, your Demons or anything like that. And I just think they'll constantly get beaten by the better teams but now in 16th next year i reckon it will be oh sorry st kilda the saints so i reckon it'll be the saints because they had a really good 2020 but i think it was just because they had a lot more on games than off games because you never really know what st kilda is going to show up to the games with St Kilda as a team in general, you know, because, like, you could get your really good, feisty St Kilda one week, but then you could get your sluggish and slow St Kilda the next. But starting in 15th, and your 15th next year, sorry, I reckon will be the Gold Coast Suns. I genuinely think it will be Gold Coast because they're not really trying to push for finals, but they're not trying to end on the bottom of the ladder. Um, in 14th next year, I feel like it will be the Pies, Collingwood Magpies in 14th next year. Because, you know, they're in a rebuild. They're going to be a lot better than they were this year. I think they're going to have, like, probably about five more wins than they will end with this year. But it'll only be enough to get them up into um, 14th. In 13th, now, this is where it starts getting a little bit trickier and you've got to really think uh, who will finish where. But in 13th, next year, I reckon the Adelaide Crows will finish in 13th. Only because I feel like they'll have just, like, one good game against Collingwood and, like, they'll beat Collingwood for one game, but Collingwood will come back the next week, like, the next time they play. But, yeah. If you, if you sort of get what I mean. But in 12th next year, I reckon it will be the Carlton Blues. You know, they're still pushing them for finals. They're still in a rebuild from from what they were, again, with Hawthorne six, seven years ago when they were making finals, but that's it. They weren't really making any grand finals. I think the last grand final they made, they lost to North Melbourne in 1999. Although they were in some more grand finals in the early 2000s, late 2000s, I don't know. But in the 11th next year... I think it will be Fremantle, I reckon it will be the Fremantle Dockers next year, starting, 
as in the tape next year the 12 13 hold on 11 In 11th next year will be Fremantle. In 10th, this definitely might surprise some of you guys, but oh, I already did up. But I think it will be the Geelong Cats. They are old and they are slow. They're looking for experience to try and get one more premiership out of them. But, you know, they got Jeremy Cameron that's going to be retiring in one to two years. Danger Fuel that's going to be retiring in two to three years. Selwood that's going to be retiring in one to two years. So, like, they're just going to be old and slow and not going to be able to keep up with, with your younger teams. Like, our next option in ninth, which will be... Hmm, toss up. I feel like they will both end, but I reckon this team will get the worst uh, end of it. I feel like the Richmond Tigers will end in ninth next year, just solely based on that. They've, I think they've just gotten too cocky, you know, winning three and four. So, you know, that's what Geelong did. They won three and six. But what, where are they now? They're fighting for the prelims. They're, fight, they're fighting for top four, let alone fighting for your grand final appearances. This is a team that I was going to put at ninth, but I thought they'll do a bit better than Richmond. So eighth, I think, is going to be Sydney Swans. Just solely based on they have such a young side. They do have their older players, but I just feel like they're going to be so young and so fast and beat your teams like Port Adelaide, who are... Got more experience, yes, but uh, older and slower. But they still do have some quickness to them. And they're going to beat your DeLongs. They're going to beat your Tigers. They're going to beat your Giants. But start, but ending in 7th next year, I think, will be the Essendon Bombers. You know, you see them this year. That they're on and off like the Saints have been in like the last five years but you know you've got them yeah but you know people always you know like shit on Essendon for their drug scandals and everything but I feel like they're they're better and Joe Watson got his brown nose stripped off him you know because of the f drug scandal you know but anyway ending in sixth next year Hold on, I've lost one. Six. Hold on, so it's six. Yep, I'm, I've lost one. Well, I think in six will be the Giants. Who am I missing though? Come with me. Guys, let me see if I can find who I'm missing. It'll be over here because this is where I cut them all out. Be on the floor somewhere. I don't see it. It's not up there. Um, drop it over here somewhere. Oh, there it is. All good. All right, so in fifth next year, I'm gonna go with the Eagles. Actually, no. I'm going to go with the Demons. Well, this is going to be my top five. I'll be back in a second, okay?